Hi everyone, I'm Sebastian. I'm a software engineer in the Visual Studio version control team. And today we're gonna to be talking about how to manage your Git tags within the IDE. Now a tag is pretty much a pointer to a commit. This means that you can mark important points in your Git repository's history to understand the different releases or milestones in your development process. Now you might be asking, how is this useful? Well, for example, last December, the version control team merged some final changes into Visual Studio and we tagged it with a tag. Now, there was a lot of changes between December and January. And then during the next milestone in January, right after we received a bug about performance where we were making one too many Git calls. So how did I figure out the issue? Well, the first thing I did was jump right into the IDE to understand the tags at play. So, I went to the IDE, went to view, and then Git repository. And in this repository window, it shows you a snapshot of your repo. Now beforehand, we used to not have tags here, but now we have branches and tags. So I expanded this tag section, and I knew in the sample repository that the latest tag that carried some changes was version 17. And when I clicked on version 17, you'll see that once again, that tag points to a specific commit and it doesn't change but I can go ahead and understand the different commits all the way to the previous release. So what I did was look through these commits and pull requests to, to find the culprit of the issue. Now, not only can you look through the list of tags and be able to see the commits that came beforehand, but if you look at the tag, you can right click on it and you can perform different tag operations, whether that be deleting the tag or pushing the tag. Now, once again, that tag is associated with a commit. So you can also perform commit specific operations related to that commit. Now, not only did the new feature bring the capabilities to manage your tags, but something that we've had in the IDE for a while is the ability to create a new tag. So if I right click on a specific commit in the graph and go to new tag, I can call this 16.1, um, let's call it beta. And then after creating it, I can look it up in the filter and I could once again perform some operations such as pushing that to the remote repository. Now you're able to create tags, you're able to perform diff different operations and understand the history before that tag occurred. So if you have any requests for this feature or how we could enhance the version control experience within the IDE, please let us know in the developer community. Thank you.